Hello, this is Yusri Yusop, and I am an associate professor in the Environmental Technology Program of the School of Industrial Technology, University of Science Malaysia, or USM. I'll be covering the multivariate statistics for environmental forensics topic for the course Environmental Forensics. Here are the learning outcomes for this topic. The first learning outcome is that you'll be able to organize information and data from different sources to solve environmental pollution challenges because in environmental forensics, you generally deal with large data sets that comes from multiple sources, such as different instruments and different methods to collect those data. The second learning outcome is that you'll be able to compare suitable statistical methods for analyzing large environmental data sets because there are many statistical methods available out there and you need to choose the right one that suits your situation. The last learning outcome is that you'll be able to suggest alternative solutions for environmental forensic problems by using these statistical methods. Because there are so many different methods that's available, you sometimes need to use a combination of these methods or even to modify some of the pre-processing steps before you can actually apply those methods onto your data before you can actually extract trends. So that's why it's very important for you to also be able to think out of the box or to be able to come up with solutions or alternative pathways providing your answers from the data sets that's available.